Greetings from Edu Aspirants, our YouTube channel to ace academics, competitive exams, entrance exams as also for enrichment of knowledge. In the series of our videos on India, in chapter 17, we will see health and family welfare in two videos. Let us see what we have for you in this first of the two videos. The Ministry of Health and Family Welfare implements various programs on the national scale in the areas of health and family welfare, prevention and control of major communicable and non-communicable diseases and promoting research across India. All these names and objectives you have to remember. The ministry has two departments, Department of Health and Family Welfare and Department of Health Research. Department of Aid Sick Control has been merged with Department of Health and Family Welfare and now known as National AIDS Control Organization, NACO. In December 2014, Department of Ayush was made Ministry of Ayurved, Yoga and Naturopathy, Yunani, Siddha and Homeopathy, that's Ayush with focused attention on development of education and research in Ayurved, Yoga, Naturopathy, Yunani, Siddha and Homeopathy systems. The latest addition to the Ayush group of healthcare systems is Sova Rigpa, the Tibetan's health tradition. This is important for your exams. National Health Policy one assurance based approach progressively incremental assurance based approach with focus on preventive and promotive health care two micronutrient deficiency focuses on reducing micronutrient malnourishment and systematic approach to address heterogeneity in micronutrient adequacy across regions three make in india initiative incentivizes local manufacturing to provide customized indigenous products for Indian population in the long run and for application of digital health, extensive use of digital tools for improving the efficiency and outcome of the healthcare system and aims at an integrated health information system which improves efficiency, transparency and citizen experience. Mission Indra Dhanush was launched in 2014 to cover all those children who have been partially vaccinated or not vaccinated during routine immunization rounds. The objective of the scheme is to increase full immunization against eight life-threatening diseases. These diseases you will have to remember. Diphtheria, whooping cough, tetanus, poliomyelitis, tuberculosis, measles, meningitis and hepatitis B. Vaccines are also provided in some states for Japanese encephalitis and Haemophilus influenza type B. These are the important diseases under mission Indradhanush so far. India Newborn Action Plan for attaining single digit neonatal mortality rate NMR and single digit still birth rate SBR by 2030 is in progress. Mother's Absolute Affection Program MAA is an intensified program to bring undiluted focus on promotion of breast feeding. Intensified Diarrhea Control Fortnite IDCF and National Deworming Day to combat soil transmitted helminth STH infections has been implemented. Rashtriya Bal Swasthya Karikram for early detection and management of four Ds which are defects at birth, diseases, deficiencies, development delays including disability, these are the four Ds and free management of 30 identified health conditions including surgery at tertiary health facilities is effective. 
राष्ट्रीय किशोर स्वास्थ्य कार्यक्रम आर के एस के प्रोवाइड इंफॉर्मेशन कॉमोडिटीज एंड सर्विसेज टू मीट द डाइवर्स नीड्स ऑफ एडोलसेंस द इंटरवेंशन अंडर आर के एस के इज वीकली आयरन फॉलिक सप्लीमेंटेशन डब्ल्यू आई एफ एस मेन्स्ट्रोअल हाइजीन स्कीम एंड पियर एजुकेटर प्रोग्राम पियर एजुकेटर प्रोग्राम द मिनिस्ट्री हैज लॉन्च आर साथिया रिसोर्स किट अंडरस्टैंडिंग द ग्रोइंग नंबर ऑफ मोबाइल बेस्ड ऐप यूजर्स साथिया सलाह ऐप हैज ऑल्सो बीन मेड पार्ट ऑफ द साथिया रिसोर्स किट जननी शिशु सुरक्षा कार्यक्रम जे एस एस के दिस स्कीम एंटाइटल्स ऑल प्रेगनेंट वीमेन डिलीवरिंग इन पब्लिक हेल्थ इंस्टीट्यूशन to absolutely free and no expense delivery including cesarean section janani suraksha yojana jsy is a safe motherhood intervention under the national health mission the objective is to reduce maternal and neonatal mortality by promoting institutional delivery among poor pregnant women family planning mission parivar vikas was launched for substantially increasing the access to contraceptives and family planning services in 146 high fertility districts of seven high focus states which are up bihar rajasthan madhya pradesh chatisgarh jharkhand and assam with total fertility rate of 3 and above you know the latest india figures is less than 2 free drugs the initiative has been launched with an objective to put in place systems such as facility wise free diagnostic services the objective is to reduce the out of pocket expenditure on diagnostics as well as to improve the quality of care national ambulance services on the achievements of nrhm is the patient transport ambulances operating under dial 108 or 102 ambulance service National Mobile Medical Unit (MMU) takes healthcare to the doorstep of the public in the rural and underserved areas, especially underserved areas. National Urban Health Mission (NUHM) is to strengthen health systems and service delivery in urban areas. Pradhan Mantri Surakshit Matritv Abhiyan (PMSMA) aims to provide assured, comprehensive, and quality antenatal care. free of cost universally to all pregnant women on the 9th of every month pradhan mantri national dialysis program pm ndp supports all states for provision of free dialysis services for the poor kayakal kayakal awards have been launched to promote cleanliness hygiene and infection control practices in public health facilities so this is a question what is kayakal award national organ transplant this program was launched for carrying out the activities as per transplantation of human organs and tissues act 1994 training of manpower and promotion of organ donation from deceased persons national organ and tissue transplant organization notto was set up at sabdarjung hospital new delhi including a national registry nottr to provide an online system for procuring and distribution of organs and tissues and to promote deceased organ and tissue donation a 24/7 call center with full toll free number 1800114770 has been established swachh swasth sarvatra is a joint initiative of the ministry of health and family welfare and ministry of drinking water and sanitation mental health care act 2017 adopted a rights based statutory framework on mental health it strengthens the institutional mechanisms for improving access quality and appropriate mental health care services hiv and aids prevention and control act 2017 aims to end the epidemic by 2030 it is in accordance with the sustainable development goals set up by the united nations medical education 
The Indian Medical Council Amendment Act 2016 paved the way for a uniform entrance exam for admission to undergraduate and postgraduate medical courses in the country, the National Eligibility Come Entrance Test, commonly called NEET, has been introduced from the academic year 2016-17 for greater transparency and ensuring better standards of medical education. Dental education. Under Dental Council of India DCI framework, more than 12 new dental colleges have been established in the last three years. Over 1,700 BDS, Bachelor of Dental Education, seats and 975 MDS, Masters of Dental Science, seats have been added. Mother and Child Tracking System, MCTS, Reproductive Child Health, RCH application is an individual based tracking system across all the states and union territories to facilitate timely delivery of antenatal and postnatal care services and immunization of children with an objective of improving IMR, MMR and morbidity. Mobile Academy is a free audio training course designed to expand and refresh the knowledge base and improve their communication skills of ASHAs. Accredited social health activists, that is what is the full form of ASHA. TB patient monitoring system, NICSHA, for tracking of individuals for treatment adherence has been implemented across all states for monitoring of TB patients. Also, a missed call toll free number 1800 is also there to contact. Tobacco Cessation Program is a mobile-based interventional initiative for counseling and helping people to quit tobacco by giving a missed call to 011-2290-1701. Diabetes Program is a mobile-based initiative for prevention and care of diabetes by giving a missed call. So much is there in terms of initiatives by the government of India. Sugam by Central Drugs Standards Control Organization CDSCO enables online submission of applications, their tracking, processing and grant of approvals online, mainly for drugs, clinical trials, ethics committee, medical devices, vaccines and cosmetics. It provides a single window for multiple stakeholders, pharma industry, regulators and citizens involved in the processes of CDSCO. National AIDS Control Program is a 100% central sector scheme. More than 10 lakh people living with HIV are on ART. 1 lakh additional patients brought under the ambit of anti-retroviral treatment, that's ART, in line with test and treat policy launched for covering all patients with ART cover. This brings us to the end of the first of the two videos on health and family welfare. Keep revising, the second of the two videos will be uploaded soon. Please subscribe, like, share and do press the bell icon for updates. Best wishes for your forthcoming exams.